Poland will receive 250 M1A2 Abrams main battle tanks from the United States in a $1.15 billion contract. The contract was awarded by the U.S. Army, U.S. Army, to General Dynamics Land Systems, GKDS. It was stated that the tank that the U.S. would send to Poland was one of the most advanced variants, namely the M1A2 Abrams SEPV-3, System Enhancement Program version 3. Poland's desire to acquire this tank sparked a year ago and only materialized this year. Assistant Secretary of the Army Doug Bush stated, The contract from the U.S. Army for Poland is an example of ongoing cooperation between the U.S. Army with industrial partners and also allied countries that are members of NATO. This contract can simultaneously increase the production of U.S. military equipment. Deliveries of Abrams SEPV-3 tanks to Poland will begin in January 2025. The Abrams M1A2 SEPV-3, System Enhanced Package, is a modern configuration of the Abrams Main Battle Tank, MBT, used by the U.S. Army. This new version offers better protection and survivability than its predecessor. The tank also features various advances in technology, including improved armor, communications, reliability, sustainability and fuel efficiency. The main gun fitted on the MBT is a M256120 mm smoothbore cannon, which can fire M829A4 advanced kinetic energy and advanced multi-purpose, AMP, rounds to defend armored vehicles, personnel and low-flying aircraft. The tank features a low-profile, LP, common remotely operated weapon system, CROWS, installed with a 12.7 mm machine gun. A 7.62mm M240 machine gun is also mounted coaxially with the main gun. The U.S. Army had previously started the Abrams Tank Training Academy on August 10 in Poznan, Poland. Poland has obtained permission to purchase 250 M1A2 SEPV-3 main battle tanks from the U.S. Department of State. The U.S. made heavyweight tank will join an equal number of German-made Leopard 2 tanks in the Polish Army. The M1A2 SEPV-3 is the latest variant of the Abrams tank as a result of combat experience in 2003.